Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Anya here and today I will teach you how to create an animated heart GIF in GIMP. So this is what the end result is going to look like. So as you can see which if frame, a stroke of the heart is being drawn. So we are going to create it in GIMP. So this, uh, so this tutorial is going to need a, a custom set of brushes. I will add link in the description below so that you can follow along the tutorial. So I will start by creating a new document. So as a size 600 by 600 pixel, background white, and hit OK. And then we are going to add some guides to the, um, to the document. So horizontal and vertical. And then I will add some light background color, uh, light rose background color to the document. And then we are going to draw the heart. Now we are going to create a new layer for it. And we are going to select the hard brush. So I'm going to take this one called Heart 3 from the custom set of brushes that uh, I have provided you. And as a color, I'll make it some kind of red. So if you want, you can copy the HTML notation. And we are going to make the heart a bit, a bit bigger. So 560 should be fine. And then we are going to arrange the angle. So min minus eight should be fine. And then you go ahead and you draw the heart. So this is going to uh, what the GIF is going to base upon. And then we are going to create a new selection, a new layer. So for each stroke, we are going to create a step, put it on a separate layer so that it can be animated. So I will create a new layer and call it heart stroke one. And then this layer, we are going to make alpha to selection. And then we are going to hide it. And then we are each, and we are going to to draw each stroke on a separate layer. And then for the for each stroke, I'm going to take an acrylic acrylic brush and about this size, 140 should be should be good. So once the lower layer is uh, hidden. And we can go ahead and start drawing it. And then for each for each uh, stroke, we are creating a separate layer and then naming naming it respectively.
Okay, so for this area here, we can rotate the brush to so that it can fit better in the area that we need to stroke. So I said we have created the heart and each different stroke of the heart is on a different layer and each of these layers is going to be the frame of the animation. So then once we have it we can create the original heart shape that we created because we are not going to need it anymore. And then we can um, unselect to remove the alpha selection by clicking Ctrl Shift A. And then we can play the animation. So we go to Filter, Animation, Playback. So it opens the animation playback window. So then you can arrange the number of frames per second and the speed at which it plays. And press the play button. So I find this is a bit too fast, so I'll make it a bit slower. Zero five. All right. So once you have it, then you can export it as a GIF. So go to File, Export as, and then you type in the title "Heart Animation" as an ending. You put that GIF. And then you select the path, which folder you want to save it in, and then you press export. And then here you select the animation, and then you can put in the delay between each frame. So you can put somewhere around 100 or 100 pt. And then you can press export, and then it exports the GIF to your destination folder. And then once you have it exported, you can play it to see the end result. So then if you are satisfied with it, then you can you can share it on social media or send it to your boyfriend, girlfriend, or upload it on some um, GIF platform such as Giphy or Tenor. So from my side, that was it for today. So if you enjoyed the tutorial or learned something from it, you can hit the like button. And until then, see you next time. Bye.